Hey everyone, Scoop Science here. Today I have here, this is a microscope that I built. It is based off the design of uh, Anthony Van Loenhoek. I can't remember if that's actually his name. It's something similar to that. But basically his design had two bits of metal that um, had a lens in between. But I've just got two bits of wood here. And then I've got this bolt that's through there and the microscope should hopefully be focused on the uh, on the tip of this so if I just move that down to where it was focused I've also got a couple of lenses here you can see these are just little glass actually I think they're plastic plastic lenses from a microscope and from a telescope I got different lenses uh, both of them here from a microscope and a telescope that I took apart it's funny because I'm using lenses from a microscope to make a microscope, but these ones actually I think were from the telescope. So, and they actually work pretty well. So now if I just push that down. Also, the way I've designed this is so it, so when I open it up, I can just push that open. I get one of my lenses, slip it in that little spot that I drew it out for it, close it back off so now I've got the lens in there which should hopefully be focused on the tip of this. So now, okay there we go. It's a bit hard to get the camera to focus on that, but you can see the actual size of it is about that big. When I bring it up, it magnifies it. Not by very much. So here it is. Here's the view of the little screw that I'm moving right now through the microscope. So you can see it magnifies it pretty well. For just using one lens. If I had a series of lens, maybe I could increase the magnification. But that's just what I got for now. Just for the microscope based off of the design of one of the, of the very first, I think, microscope to ever be made. So just like that. So you can see there's the lens through there focused on, so this bolt there, it's just focused through there. I got that angled and then you can just see it through there. Oh, the lens has fallen out of place. There we go. So you can see it through there like that. Which I think is pretty cool. Now using just one lens and two couple bits of wood I can actually make a microscope. Well, so that was a cool short little video, I think. Um, if you want to see, if you want to get a better insight on how this actually works, go and check out uh, my friend from the channel called Nathan's Scientific Stuff. He actually made a video on this as well. He made his own microscope. I think his turned out a little bit better than mine though, but he actually explains this a little bit more. Um, about this, about this design, how it works. So there'll be a link in the description for that if you want to see that. Also, I've mentioned it before, but I'm on Patreon. If you don't know what that is, that's a crowdfunding campaign where you can 
donate as little or as much as you want to help out people and so in this case you'll be helping me out, help me make videos um, and if you wanted to see the behind the scenes footage and the build process of this microscope and behind the scenes of every other video that I'm going to post from now on then all it is is just donating two dollars a month that's all it is and you get access to all the behind the scenes for every single video that I'm going to be posting from now on just for donating two dollars a month so there will also be a link in the description for my Patreon page if you wanted to check that out uh, but anyway if you did enjoy that video please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to see future videos like this